Hey, it's Adam with webstarts.com. Thanks for tuning in. In this short video, I'm going to show you how to embed a Google Sheet, that's Google's spreadsheet application, into your website using both Google Sheets as well as Web Starts. But before I do that, I'd like to invite you to tap the subscribe button and enable notifications. That way you'll be the first to find out when I release a new video on web design, internet marketing, search engine optimization, and a variety of other subjects. All right, let's get into this uh, walkthrough of embedding this Google Sheet onto my Web Starts website. You can see here that I've already signed up for a Web Starts account. If you haven't done that, go to webstarts.com and sign up. It's totally free. Once you're logged into that account, you'll see a view similar to the one that I'm looking at here, and we call this the dashboard. On the dashboard is a thumbnail to your website, and there's also a link to your website as well. And if I click on that link, you'll see here, this is nothing more than a Google Sheet that I've embedded into my web page. It has some charts on it, as well as uh, various data entries you can tab between uh, the different views on your spreadsheet. So let's see how I did that by going over to Google Sheets. If you don't have a Google Sheets account, it's uh, inside of your Gmail account. You can click on the little icons in the top right corner and then you can open up Google Sheets and you'll see something like this. Now this is just a template that they provide and it's for creating a monthly budget and of course just like any other spreadsheet application you can enter into these fields and put whatever data that you're keeping track of. We'll save that for a different video but in this video I'm going to show you how to get the embed code that you need so you can move this sheet on over to your website. You do that by clicking on file and you go publish to web, up pops this modal and you're going to want to click on the embed tab. From there, you can choose to embed either the entire document or you can just embed a specific tab. For this video, I'm going to embed the entire document. So I've chosen that option. Then I just click to select the embed code and then I can press command C if I'm on an Apple or control C if I'm on a Windows based computer or I can right click and choose copy as well then move back on over to your web starts website click on the edit site button when you hover above the site thumbnail in the dashboard view and then from there all you need to do is click insert HTML code agree that you know what you're doing and paste that code into the field provided and finally click OK you can drag and drop your spreadsheet wherever you want it to appear on your page you can also use the handles to change the width and the height that you want to view your spreadsheet. So if I didn't want to require people to scroll down to view the entire spreadsheet, then I would just continually expand this sheet downward using the handle. When you're ready, click the Save button, and then those changes are going to be immediately saved and then you can just click refresh and view what that looks like on your live website. All right, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to tap subscribe and enable notifications. We'll see you next time and be sure to sign up to create your very own free website, online store or blog at webstarts.com.